In this video, I'm going to talk about how to mobilize the first and second rib that are up here in your kind of where your neck meets your clavicle. And sometimes when these ribs are elevated from tension or chest breathing, it can affect the nerves that either run down your arm or up your neck. So you're going to need a scarf or a belt. And we'll say that this is my affected side. So my rib might appear like a little bit elevated and I can't get it down like this side. So you're gonna take this scarf and put it across your body. And grab it in the back. So the same side hand that you're treating is gonna grab the scarf in the back. So the scarf kind of does, um, goes across your body like, <clears throat> like a sash. And then what you're gonna wanna do is pull so that the back hand is pulling more than the and then the front hand. So if you see from the side, there's going to be kind of a backwards motion to my shoulder girdle. You want that to be kind of close up to the neck. So pull down with both hands, but a little bit more on the back side. So you really want to stabilize that um, joint. And then you're slowly going to allow your neck to stretch away from the scarf and then just very gently take some deep breaths and you're going to allow your chin to move towards your collarbone you're not you're not pushing you're just letting gravity do this work and then you're going to allow your chin to kind of twist toward the ceiling nice deep breaths Bring your chin down towards your collarbone, let it drop towards the floor, but keep that tension on the strap. And you can do that as often as you need to reduce tension. Might be a good idea to do both sides as well. So maybe spend a total of two or three minutes doing that and then observe your shoulders. Do they line up a little bit better? Did this one drop down a little bit more? And that'll be it.